quick video for you. I just want to introduce another software that the district is uh, purchased for us that we can use at the premium subscription level, and that is Canva. Consider PowerPoint or Google Slides as your starting point. Canva takes your customization and time saving up a level. Um, not only can you customize these slides, but they have templates built into this online platform for virtually any subject. It's got everything and it has templates for any kind of presentation that you'd like to build. Not only that, but at the end of each slide template, presentation template, uh, they have a resource page that has all sorts of images that you can use to make your own slides if you need to make more than just what the template has. So it's really easy to use. It's a matter of copy and paste. Um, the images, graphics, photos, um, all these designs that they have are infinitely scalable. If you've ever tried to put a picture in PowerPoint or Google Slides and drag those corners to make it bigger and it gets all grainy and your kids can't see very well, they have an immersive photo library where you can search through the images that they have access to and those images will scale and will look beautiful no matter what size or what device your presentation is on. All right, one thing I'd like to do before I get too deep into today's video is pause and thank our sponsors. Today's video is brought to you by Thirsty Thursday. If you've got thirst that needs quenching, head down to the faculty lounge and get yourself one of these. A nice, cool, refreshing beverage. Just the thing you need to take your teaching to the next level. Thirsty Thursday. Go get some. One of the other favorite things that Canva has built into its presentation suite is a built-in timer. So if you have students working on a question, maybe put a question on the board, you want them to discuss or work on a problem, it's as simple as pushing the number five to start a five minute timer. With this timer also comes some fun features like music that it'll play while your kids are working. And so that's a really excellent way to cue students how much work time they have left by looking at the clock. And also it will change sounds when it starts counting down from 10 seconds. To help your students know that, boom, time is done, time to move on. And if we build this into our workflow, uh, it can become a really easy way to make seamless transitions from one topic to the next. Yeah, there you go. That's Canva. Just a really quick sneak peek at why I like it, why I use it, and why I think you should try it out too. All of these tips are for you to maximize your workflow, to spend less time doing the stuff you don't like, and more time doing the stuff you do, and that's interacting with the kids and building up their high school experience. All right, um, I think that's it. So really quick, really simple. If you're interested in learning more about Canva and how you can use it in your classroom and all of the other amazing features it has, reach out to me and we can schedule a time and I am happy to come help make your workflow just a little bit smoother. And uh, yeah, what's thanks for watching. Now, what's left is right. Chasing stars and holding you. I can't see the end, but we'll see it through.